Hi everyone, thank you for watching the Iowa Association of Business and Industries Weekly Business Report. This week we'll be talking about the ABI Annual Conference. We're only one week away. We're excited to see so many of you in Iowa City, Coralville. Mike, can you tell us a little bit about what safety protocols that will be in place for all attendees at the conference? Thanks, Nicole. And first let me say, we hope all of you can make the conference. It's going to be a fantastic event. We're excited to get together. And there are a ton of things we're doing to make sure everybody is safe and healthy. Number one, we're holding the event in an exhibition hall, the kind of hall that houses farm equipment shows and big, big equipment shows, not a ballroom. So lots of room to spread out. People will be socially distant. Distant. If, you're, uh, if you've been vaccinated, there's no need for you to wear a mask. If you haven't, please do wear a mask. Um, if you have symptoms, of course, uh, of any kind of illness, please don't attend. There'll be lots of hand sanitizer, again, lots of distance. But we're really mainly looking forward to a terrific, terrific event. So we look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you, Mike. And in addition to ABI President Mike Ralston, we also have Director of Member Programs, Holly Muggenberg, here to share with us a little bit about some of the highlights for the annual conference. Holly? Thanks, Nicole. We have a lot of things happening at the conference this year, many of them large networking events as well as programming for everybody in attendance. Uh, Tuesday we will start with golf and non-golf options, and then we will roll into our welcome reception, which will be held at the Extreme Arena. Wednesday we have a full day of programming in the morning, which will feature Dr. Barrett, the CEO of Girls Who Code, and Jeff Colvin, the senior editor at large with Fortune and best-selling author. We'll also hear from Governor Kim Reynolds, who will address our full attendance at the, the luncheon on Wednesday. Our workshops will be uh, rounding out our programming on Wednesday, and then that evening we will help hold our chairs reception and dinner at the Big Grove Brewery. Thursday we will also have programming for all the attendees, and we will um, honor our Leadership Iowa graduates that day, as well as have our Leadership for Iowa award. and then give our attendees kind of a taste of what we will have coming up in 2022. Great. Sounds like an excellent event. And I'm thank you to Holly Nicole. for, go ahead. Well, you're going to do it. I'm going to do it too. <laughs> I want to say thank you to Holly. Everybody on the ABI team works incredibly hard. Holly uh, does a terrific job with all our events, but especially planning the uh, conference and, and making sure we're ready for that. I do want to say, if you haven't heard Tarika, Dr. Tarika Barrett, you don't want to miss her. She's terrific. Jeff Colvin, everybody knows from his books and his work at Fortune Magazine, terrific speakers. We, we can't wait to get everybody together. I'm sorry, Nicole, I'm done. No, that's exactly what I was going to say, Mike. Holly likes to be behind the scenes, so we're really excited that she could join us here on video this week for this week's biz weekly business report. So I want to encourage you all to join us next week in Iowa City, and thanks so much for your support of ABI.